heard it, it became an instant joke. Okay. All right, let's make sure we've got good we got good sound test. Hello, I'm Orion. <laughs> <laughs> that might be the best noise you've ever made. <laughs> okay. Hi. Ah. Oh, we're starting. We're playing this game. Oh dear God. So I did some research on this beforehand. Oh really? You did? So this, yeah. So this is infamous, and I really wanted to know why. I mean, I know why. It's like one to consider one of the worst games of all time. But I, I mean, like. Mm -hmm. I've played a little bit of this before, like I said, I was telling you. Um. And, um, it's glitchy, it's buggy, and there's no way any, like, executive or anybody working this game could have looked at this and said, like, hey, this is good, let's release this. There's no way, it's not possible. The people working this had to, knew, had to know it was bad, right? Yeah. They did. I guess it was apparently rushed out for a Christmas release, and this yep. game is actually unfinished. Yeah, actually, like... Well, I mean, technically all the levels are there, but you know, yeah, they don't... Yeah, but I mean, like, this... this they, they don't have the necessary polish. They skipped beta testing, they skipped polishing, this game is actually unfinished. They pushed it out for... Yeah. The same thing that happened to Sonic Boom, I think. You'd think they would have learned their lesson. Yeah. Also, also, there's some interesting stuff about this, uh, here, opening cinematic. Allow me to regurgitate some facts from Did You Know Gaming, if you don't mind. Okay. Apparently, like, this was... This is sort of a relic of a different kind of game that Sega wanted to make, set in a realistic world. But then they realized Sonic's 15th anniversary was coming up, and they were like, Oh shit! So they just put the two ideas together. So, well, I just want to say, this looks better than the rest of the game. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's pre-rendered and shit, but like, I think even the other cutscenes in this game don't look as good as this cutscene. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I know. I mean, I will say, though, that uh, her face is a little bit weak. It's, it's kind of in the uncanny valley, but if it had a little bit more polish, it could probably be up there with a Final Fantasy cutscene. It's, it's, it's very close. It's very close. I don't know, I'd smash. <laughs> Uh, no, why? No, she does have that sort of uncanny, like, Final Fantasy movie kind yeah. of. Mm -hmm. Remember that? I do remember that. Can we do like a this except for watching a movie instead of playing a game with no, that movie? We'd get copyrighted, dude. Oh, you're right. It'd be really awesome. It w it would be super fun to do, but actually, I think there might be other sites that let us do that. I don't know. I'd have That'd to look fun. into it more. I mean, it would be just like Mystery Science Theater, I guess. Yeah. No, yeah. that movie was bad. <laughs> yeah, so I hear. Dad actually thinks it was good, though. Really? I don't I mean, know I if he's... It was, I think it was good independently. It was just it had nothing to do with Final Fantasy. Actually, actually, depending on who you ask, like, it wasn't even good independently. It was... It could have been, like, really... I don't, well, I mean, I've seen Pro really? Jared's review. He just said, like, it was... It was... It didn't... It didn't have anything to do with the rest of Final Fantasy. Didn't... What did... Was not... Was a very boring standalone film. By the way, realistic Eggman. Yeah. Right? Oh my god, wow. Oh my god. His mustache is like, it's so weird seeing it as like actually a hair material. Yeah, it's actually like rendered. Holy yeah. Jesus. Like, it looks okay as like a blob of clay on his face, but like actually rendered as hair? It kind of <laughs> just creepy. Yeah. Well, I mean, there's no way that hair actually follows those physics unless you put like a shit ton of hair gel in that. Yeah. I mean, it's like a tribble, like sort of slowly eating his face. Oh, hello there! Oh, completely god. out of place. Oh dear god. <laughs> I, thought, I thought the game was skipping there for a second because it was like. This doesn't look. Oh, this, he looks like they just. Like Adobe After Effects Tim in. No, he, lo he looks part of it. It's just. He's just artistically different from just about everything. Yeah. Like you know those asset flip games you see on Steam that yeah. like just take that just take tons of different Unity assets off the Unity <laughs> Asset Store and like amalgamate them to one game so they don't have any sort of consistent art style or like yeah. anything. It looks like that. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Hi Trunks. Iblis trigger. <laughs> <laughs> like they oh, were basically. <laughs> I'm so Iblis triggered right now. <laughs> Oh, you heard what I said, right? Yeah, it's Trunks from DBZ. Yeah. Dibs. Yeah, the yeah the actual like character description says, essentially think Trunks from Dragon Ball Z. He traveled back in time to prevent his future from. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> it's way. <d> <laughs> Watch! Watch as the graphics get an immediate downgrade. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Oh my god! Yay! 
He didn't even really bounce. He just kind of. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, he uh, was uh. like. Uh, they didn't animate it. <laughs> well, no. The, okay, I'm just. You know what I mean? They didn't. I'm, like, I'm sorry. I'm like way too literal. I'm sorry about that. He was that. making no movements. He was just sort of. Yeah, they just dra they just dragged him along. Yeah, That's just dragged they, him along like, like a path. Yeah. Like okay, he goes over here. Go over here. Go over here. That's what he did. I got it. I got it. A chili dog. <laughs> Uh, I think they didn't. I don't think they. I don't think they introduced chili dogs at this point. I think that wasn't, wasn't until that like. Was that the cartoon with um? Oh, whoops! I'm sorry. I uh, I lost my Sonic history. Yeah, no. I heard that was called. The, didn't uh, Urkel voice him in that cartoon? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if someone tries to touch you in a place or in a way that <laughs> forgot, Sonic says that ain't cool. <laughs> That's no good. That's no good. Yeah. And did I do that? <laughs> <laughs> I completely forgot Urkel voiced Sonic at one point. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, look, Sonic's just not moving. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's just totally enamored with that. Oh, boy. Soliana. Soliana. We so get to, we get to, we get to really learn about Soliana. There's a skip in this city that well, you can, I think it's like some NPC that you talk to and you act, you activate an item and then go back and talk to him again and it skips straight to the credits. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, I've seen, I've seen the Glitch Fest video like five times now. Yeah. <laughs> I know how to do it, but for the sake of- Oh yeah, of, no, for the sake of not, you for know, For the I sake of the, the audience. Yeah. Yeah, for the sake of the audience's patience, we'll actually like, we'll actually like- No, oh I, wanna, I wanna, I wanna- I am actually game. touching a controller, making me control Sonic in one of the worst games ever. Yes. I, I played this game. I didn't finish it. Got it. I finished it. I got to like, I think actually the game glitched. It was a game breaking glitch. And I couldn't finish it. Uh oh. Yeah. It was the, fir the first or second silver level. Okay. Oh, I, I saw a fox with two tails over the plaza. It seemed like he was looking for someone. You might as well look at me while you're talking to yeah. me. But no, I guess that's just not. Do you know that Tails' real name is Miles Prower? Yes. <sighs> Tails is a nickname. It's... Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of strange that they would give him the nickname Tails, but yeah, it's fine. Well, then what's... Well, do you get it, though? Miles per hour? Miles per hour? Oh. So... Uh, well, then what's then what's Sonic... Then what's Sonic's rev real name? Is it Rev Sonic Illusions? I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't know. That was That was pretty bad, though. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not good I, at I heard you. I heard what you were going for. But no, I'm not joking about that. That's an actual fact. Oh, is it like... Yeah, Tails' real name is Miles Prower. Oh, wait, look, the... look. Look at Sonic. He stops moving. <laughs> <laughs> it was according to the canon that that's actually Tails' real name. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah, that was all the way back in the in Sonic 2, the first game he was in. Really? Yeah. It's. I think there was like some... I think there was like some text on like the stage select or something that said Miles, Tails, Prower or something like that. Um. <clears throat> uh. This wait, no. This game's loading times are atrocious. <laughs> they are. There's. Oops, sorry. Whoa. Oops. Though no I. No way it can be taking this long to load that. Yeah. Exactly. Well, no. They ha they had to like load the cutscene though. Yeah. They had. That's that's what they. That's what their issue is. All right. <laughs> There's a mirror beyond the line of rings. <laughs> it looks like a fucking Unity asset. It does. It really does. Right, it looks on. like they fucking like made her and make human in like three seconds. Oh, good inverted camera controls, my favorite. You can change it. Oh, I can. All right, I I'll so. I'll do that off screen sometime. Okay. For now, I'll just I deal. play inverted. I'll though, just deal so. with it. Huh? Huh? Mm. I was oh. taking a walk by the beach, and suddenly I, all these mechs appeared. He doesn't have kind of look about him, doesn't he? <laughs> and suddenly all these mechs appeared. I barely got here alive. Thanks, middle aged what, man. What are you doing? What sir? is their animation? What are they I wonder trying what's going to convey on at the beach? with this movement that they are doing? <laughs> it's. I don't know. Oh, wait. Hold on. <laughs> I'm sorry. I tried to show you something, but I think they all went off into the distance. I think there might be more in this other one, though. Hold on. That's the thing, like. This isn't exclusive to this game, nope. or even bad games, but that's another thing I always hear about these types of games, is the NPCs that just sort of stand there doing nothing. Yeah. I, mean, I, I always prefer a more alive role the NPCs are doing shit. Yeah. Like Oblivion or Skyrim, when like, they're actually walking around living their lives, not just standing here waiting to be talked to by a blue hedgehog. Yeah. 
All right, so this guy makes awesome shoes. He's gonna give us shoes, custom shoes to be precise. Ah. There's no one that can test the full potential of these shoes. Is there anyone who can test the design of these shoes? <laughs> Have I mentioned I like shoes? I make shoes, that's my living. Well, I love that there's, there's no one that can test these shoes. Isn't there anyone that can test these shoes? <laughs> I know, that's kind of what I was doing, yeah. I think. Jesus, my thumb is so sweaty, I don't even know if I'll be able to unlock my phone. Uh, actually, hold on. Yeah, I can. The winder of the shoemaker. The, the what? What? The what does that even mean? <laughs> I wonder if it's maybe a typo and it meant wonder. The wonder of a shoemaker. <laughs> Put on the shoes and go through the ring. If I made the shoes correctly, you'll make it on time. Wi winder? They spent- What was that? <laughs> they spent 15 seconds just to load that one dialogue <laughs> box. I swear, I this almost wonder if- This is atrocious! This is unforgivable! I almost- Oh, really? This is unforgivable so far? How? Let's wait until we actually start playing, eh? Going through rings! Oh, that worked so well in Superman 64. Yeah, I- Well, fucking- <laughs> Yeah, anybody can compare this game to friggin' Superman 64. Well, you know, it I mean, takes, like- It takes talent to say anything new, and clearly we have none. <laughs> I say, everybody- All right. Everybody knows that- Look, if you wanna, if you wanna make a good okay. game, just copy design mechanics from the epitome of good games. So oh, oh, oh! Okay, oh I'm like super twitchy when I go up in the air. Like I swear, it ah! just doesn't look like it controls well. It doesn't. It's <laughs> it's super super twitchy. Like I've even played some. Oh, was it like the good kind of like Super Meat Boy twitchy or? No, not the good. No. Well, no. When in Super Meat Boy, you only have to go up, down, left, and right. Yeah. Money? I don't want any money. I'm just happy knowing that they're being used. <laughs> He's really- he is really happy. He is really happy. <laughs> what are you so angry about? Is it just his movements? It, yes! It's the movements, the dialogue, everything about this character. Yay! Well, at least we completed the first mission. Like, I don't walk up to him and be like, I am so happy that we're playing video games together, Orion. This is a lot of fun playing video games with my friend. Orion. You know people can't see you, right? Yeah, I know, but I'm wiggling my arms vigorously in the air for the yeah. people at home. <laughs> I'm it's imitating like, the movements you're of these like, characters. You're like Gil in that one episode of The Simpsons. Dance for you? You won't see it. Uh, okay, okay, I'm dancing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit, I stopped the timer. Oh no. Well, okay, that's fine. I'm just gonna buy the- I'm just gonna buy the light chip and then move on. Oh, okay. Alright. The what? Oh! I got stuck in the window. Oh. Yay. I remember this guy. Okay. I keep forgetting hey. the- I keep forgetting the X button. He like, looks like some <laughs> dude that you like see just- <laughs> He looks like a Grand Theft Auto 4 NPC. Yeah, he totally does! <laughs> What the fuck is he doing in a Sonic game? And I mean, I know there's, I mean, I know there's been humans in the Sonic Adventure games, but even they look cartoony at least. Okay, so whatever. We've got the light He's chip now. He's not from the same game. Hey, are you leaving already? Come again soon. Okay. All right. Well, now we've got the light chip, so we can, so we can make our way to the first level. A lot of progress made this first episode, but you're gonna have to tune in next time to see what we do with it. Until then.